Hello Aries, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to your reading. So please keep in mind that this is a general reading. It will not resonate for everyone. Okay, let's see please bear for Aries. What message for Aries? Unstable. So someone here could be unstable in this connection. And then, you know, obviously the connection does become unstable, right? When there's just one person that doesn't offer um, any stability, okay? Because it has to be equal give and take. <clears throat> then the connection becomes unstable as well. Let's see. What message for Aries, please? For, what message for Aries? For Aries. Non-action. So someone is, you know, not taking action here towards this connection at this point. You could, you know, be at a standstill because there's a you know a breakup a separation uh maybe you're not communicating as well here okay let's see what message for aries please what message for aries soul searching okay so that's why someone you know is not taking action at this point because someone is very unstable here, okay, and they need to go within. They need to uh, withdraw, okay, go within and do some soul searching, trying to find, you know, their way here. They might be a little bit lost, okay, they've lost their way in this connection. You're not going in the same direction, okay. Let's see, what message for... For Aries, please. What message for Aries? Marriage. Uh, Aquarius had the same card here. So you could have been married, okay, with this person. There was a possibility of marriage or long-term commitment here, okay? Or someone might still want to get married here, okay? And doing some soul-searching. To figure out you know what it is that they want let's see what message please for Aries what message you have for Aries temptation okay so there was t some temptation and interference here okay in this connection so Aquarius had you know maybe you're dealing with an Aquarius because they had a, a few cards that were <clears throat> the same let's see please bear what message for Aries what message please for Aries eight of one so they definitely do want to communicate okay so maybe after doing this soul searching okay they are thinking about reaching out to you okay in the future Let's see, why is the Eight of Wands here? 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 The world. So they want a new beginning here with you. There was an ending, okay? And now they want to start fresh. They want to start something new. Yeah, because after this soul searching, you know, they realize that they want, they, they want to be with you. That you are the one for them, probably. So, let's see. Why is the world here, please, Spirit? Why is the world here? Why is the world here? The Four of Wands. Marriage. Commitment. Long-term commitment here. So, yeah. I feel that they want, you know, they do want this with you. They still want this with you. They want to get back to this connection here. I think they've realized you are the one here. So this person has healed, okay? They've gained some wisdom, okay? About this connection and what it means to them. 
and yeah i feel that they you know they want to spend the rest of their lives with you here let's see what message for aries please what message for for aries <clears throat> please spirit what message for aries what message for aries the empress the empress is upright so the empress here is the uh, feminine energy okay she's in her full power she knows her value her worth okay so if they took you for granted before now they realize your value here okay they realize that you're very nurturing okay that you invest a lot in relationships yeah that you are the one here you are the one for for them so this is very beautiful here why is the empress here please why is the empress here why is the empress here why is the empress here the five of swords in the reverse so they want to make amends here okay so there was this sabotage okay of this connection here someone sabotage with the temptation being unstable okay and now they want to make amends here okay i want to make amends with you with this empress you could want that as well okay to make amends with them They might be letting go of uh, ego and pride, okay, and wanting to make amends here with you. Why is the Five of Swords in the reverse, please? Why is the Five of Swords in the reverse? The Foo, okay, in the reverse. There's, you know, there are some delays here, okay, probably because someone is doing some soul searching. There could be some fears attached to that. You know still lingering because you know uh of what it is that you're going to say what it is you know but yeah but definitely you know expect communication here for now in the near future because they still might not be ready to take that big leap of faith towards long-term commitment yet okay they still have really to release these fears okay and do some healing let's see what message for aries please what message do you have for aries please the magician so this is your card aries virgo gemini and scorpio so someone is really manifesting this empress this connection okay while they're doing some soul, soul searching okay they might be manifesting this let's see why is the magician here why is the magician here why is the magician here the queen of wands so this is your card aries leo or sagittarius you are in the reverse so you're not taking any action here okay so i feel you expect for them to come to you okay if they are the ones you know who um sabotage this connection you expect for them to to come to you here okay why is the queen of wands here in the reverse Why is the Queen of Wands here in the reverse? Wands in the reverse. The Eight of Swords. Okay. So this is very, very positive. Okay. So either it's you or them, but you know, releasing fears. So someone is releasing their their fears. So I feel that it, you know, it might be them. That they're releasing these negative thinkings, you know negative thoughts um yeah releasing fears about this connection okay so while they're healing 
let's see so that they could take that leap of faith here okay why what message please for aries what message do you have for aries please spirit aries. the four of pentacles in the reverse so someone is more open now to this connection okay so they, they that's why they want to reach out to you okay they are more aware of what this connection means to them. Okay, they're not closed off. They're not guarded anymore. They're releasing these fears. And that's what, you know, is going to help them uh, reach out to you. Why is the Four of Pentacles in the reverse, please, Spirit? Why is the Four of Pentacles in the reverse? The Knight of Wands. So they are coming towards you with a lot of passion, okay? But be careful because the Knight of Wands is a player type of energy here, okay? So either they have a lot of passion for you, okay? Uh, they might have changed their ways and just, they just, you know, this passion that they have for you still remains, okay? But you know hopefully they have healed their player ways here so be careful here okay because they're coming why is the knight of wands here let's see why is the knight of wands here why is the knight of wands here The six of pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, so unstable. But this, you know, could be past energy, okay? This um, knight of wands and six of pentacles in the reverse. This could have been, obviously, this, this obviously is past energy, okay? Because after doing this healing and soul searching, you know, That's not what they want, okay? What they want, it's this. This commitment here, okay? So they will release, you know, this type of energy here where there was no equal give and take, very unstable, okay? So this is definitely past energy. So what I see for now is that someone, you know, is going to do this healing and, you know, releasing these fears and um, communication, okay? So... It's up to you, right, if you want to um, give them, you know, another chance here. Okay. Let's see. Please hear what message for Aries. What message for Aries? What message for Aries, please? I wish I could open my heart for you. They can, okay? And they will. I see that they will, okay? But maybe not now, okay? So when they will communicate, you know, it's it may not be a lot of emotional communication here, okay? At the beginning. Spirit, what message for Aries? What message have for Aries? I am unhappy without you. Please, Spirit, what message for Aries? What message do you have for Aries? I don't know what to say to you. Okay. Yeah, because, you know, they might be uh, scared of, you know, what it is that you're going to say to them, okay? So they know they hurt you. They know that you are hurt. But they also know that you know your value, okay? And you want stability in your life, okay? 
Let's see, what message for Aries, please? I want to come back to you, yeah. They want to come back to you. But hopefully not with this player energy, right? Because once someone has healed here and done some soul searching, they're not supposed to come with the player energy, okay? Or unstable energy. Let's see. What message for Aries, please? What message do you have for Aries? I have change for the better. Yeah. Okay. So, like I said, it's up to you, right? If you if you do see that they have changed, and if you want to give them a second chance, okay? But they need to prove it, right? Not just say it. You need to have proof, okay? The Four of Wands is here. So I feel that they do want commitment here with you. Let's see. What message for Aries, please? What message for Aries? Don't reject me. Fear, right? Fear of being rejected. If they reach out to you, that's why they don't know what to say to you. And at the bottom, I still have hope we will be together. Beautiful. Okay. So it is positive. Okay. So you decide the extent of damage that was done. Okay. And if they do, um, you know, get it another chance here. Okay. So that's it, Aries. So I hope it resonated with you. I hope you enjoyed your reading. Take care. Bye.